here we have a beautiful Greek Orthodox Church under construction. This is one of the churches that was destroyed in 9-11 and um, they uh, redid it. I know it's 2020, it's taking a little time. There was a disagreement with the Port Authority over like how much property space the church was going to have, where it was going to be located, but everything is moving along. It's just a little bit more challenging to get the proceeds to get everything done, but the church is here. You can see it's located right next to this beautiful World Trade Center. It's just incredible seeing all this. And this is the area around the church. You can see all the buildings here. Hotels, everything. Take a closer look at the construction and how it's progressing. This is actually over a parking lot. So they, uh, that was one of the difficulties with getting this done. They had to uh, figure out how this space was gonna bear the weight of the construction of a church over a parking lot because the church was designed a little bit bigger than the original church. Just a slightly different perspective of the Greek Orthodox, or, <clears throat> Orthodox Church, St. Nicholas Greek Orthodox Church. It's considered a national shrine. You can see here, it's just beautiful around here. And this is looking towards the east and all the buildings that are around here from the platform for the Greek Orthodox Church. Another view of the church, still under construction scheduled to be opened in 2021. You see they're getting closer with uh, the painting going on of the top parts. The uh, church that was here before 9-11 in 2001 was really narrow. It was maybe about uh, 18 feet wide. It was a townhouse, but uh, part of the deal with the state of New York and the Port Authority was that they were going to have a much bigger space which is right here, because the Port Authority needed to use the church's previous space for other purposes. So that was the deal. And uh, it took a lot of effort on the Greek community's part in New York to get the deal done, because when you're dealing with the states of New York and New Jersey, it's not always easy because there's a lot of opinions. And that's why it took much longer uh, than it should. But it's uh it's about to be concluded and but that's part of when you deal with big government organizations but <laughs> churches have been dealing with government organizations for 2000 years so they're used to it so you have two big organizations dealing with each other they'll come to some sort of agreement and that's what happened here uh, 21 years later after the event took place you have the church finally almost done and you can see from this vantage point what everything looks like around the church. And this park area is really great for where the church is. Still another view of the church and the surrounding area around here. That is the World Trade Center area here. Another walkway down to the World Financial Center.